1137 Washington. The brick house. Brick looks a little like faded in some areas. It needs some repairs on the front and the siding on the back. Doesn't quite match. Some pretty decent looking houses. Not a lot of board ups. Although the next door neighbor is boarded up in the back of the house, not in the front. A couple nicer looking ones have been rehabbed. And there's a board up about five houses down that way. It's a flat roof, you can't see. Up there, I don't know, it needs paint at least, maybe a little more. Front door, and it's dark in here, there's no lights. Yeah. You're good. Oh, yeah, I'll say, she's an old friend of herself. Yeah, 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 of course. I'm a, yeah, doing the, the vid now. So. Okay, all right. Yeah, I was just explaining to her that I couldn't really hear you on the telephone. And so it just made me wonder who I was dealing with. No, no problem. Yeah. Because I told her when I was driving, you know, the phone kept cutting, cutting in and out, you know? Yep. It's a living area. All stucco, plaster that's textured. I'm talking to my camera here. You're good. Oh, oh. okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you must got a nice camera. Yeah, it takes the sound and everything. You okay. It's the dining area. I'm not sure actually. In here, it's, better. it's basically a stairway. Downstairs, kitchen here. Get the brick exposed on this side. And here there's some floor level issues. And back here, notice there's a step here that steps down into what's a laundry room now. And this is an addition. So this wall right here is the foundation of the house. Backyard fence and the porch need some repairs, as well as the walkway is brick, but it's pretty messed up. Alleyway back here, it's definitely big enough for a compact car. Put a parking pad back here. Um, but it'd be a little tight for a SUV or a truck. Can't really see the top of the house from right here, but there's a tree, but uh, what else? Other neighbors do have decks that are rooftop decks, so you could probably put one on here. Oh yeah. Like here they have here they have this siding. There, it's different. And also, this neighbor looks uh, abandoned. 
Maybe if it's not abandoned, they got a bunch of board ups. It's not abandoned. It's not abandoned, but they're not the. Uh, it's not. It doesn't look like they're the most well kept. All right, we'll go up first. Thank you. And up here, there's definitely some floor level issues back here into the bathroom. Straight up the stairs to your left. It's just a really small, really just storage area. And full bath back here. No tile in here right now. Copper is all plumbing throughout the house. It actually looks good. Problem with adding a rooftop that went off the back here and then up is that you'd have to walk through the bathroom to get to it. Yeah, I said just a little storage room here. Not even eight feet, not even seven feet wide, about five. And stairs, and then two rooms. But you have to walk through one room to get to the other. Straight ahead. So, bedroom. No closet area. It's good size. Brick on this wall. This is actually drywall on just this wall and it's textured you see like the rest of the house it's got the swirly texture and the ceilings aren't drywalled on an angle for some reason Windows, pretty good shape, vinyl windows, a few of them are in better condition than others. Definitely some kind of issue up on the ceiling there at some point. Yeah, what you had, what I had was a leak at one time. Yeah, a leak at some time. Has the roof been repaired or it, replaced it, since it's then? Been, it's been tied, but what it needs to be is retied again. Hot tied though, instead of just the plain old regular yeah, so tie. I think yeah. the roof needs to be redone. And down uh, here, short ceilings about six one. And you got electric panel over here, which the face is off, but all the wiring looks fine. And it's a 100 amp panel. Nothing down there. The joists look pretty good. Won't see any termite damage. No mold, it's dry down here. A little bit of moisture there. That's from the uh, uh, water tank. Turn off out. Furnace. Brand new. Furnace is brand new? Brand new furnace. Brand new hot water tank. And the hot water here. And all the uh, plumbing looks replaced. It's all copper throughout the house.
And I think that's it. The foundation looks good. I don't see any real issues uh, in the brick foundation. All looks pretty good. No cracks. No bulging.